هذا هو اليوم الذي صنعه الرب فلنفرح ولنتهلل به المسيح قام من بين الأموات ووطئ الموت بالموت ووهب الحياة للذين في القبور المسيح قام من بين الأموات ووطئ الموت بالموت ووهب الحياة للذين في القبور Christos on est ti e plecron thanaton, thanaton batisas, ke ti sentit ni mas i zoif karis amenos. Well, hello everybody. Uh, welcome back to the next segment of Big Bang Theory's BTS vlog. Messiah come, Christos on est ti, and Christ is risen. Now on to our time and date stamp. It is 10 hours and 46 minutes into the day of Thursday, May 26th, 2016. Yeah. Uh, the day has gone pretty well. Uh, it's the end of the day for me. I thought I might be able to push myself a little further and go food shopping around 11 o'clock. Yeah, about 15 minutes, but I'm in no shape to do that, so I'll have to push that off until Friday, until tomorrow. Uh, another vlog is in the is uh, just finished rendering. I'm going to bring it over to the, the uh, desk here, to the uh, uh, editing desk, so I can uh, uh, sort of take a look at it and uh, make a decision as to what I'm going to title it. This is one of those days where, uh, where, well, things went well. I, I even actually got some work in the music stu music studio, electronics bench done. I actually upgraded the systems there to to bring them to current, so they're back on the network. They're upgraded. They're now ready to start working. But the fatigue that's been dogging me all day long is it has left, and so it's been a push and a struggle to sort of get even very simple things done so and when you get like this way for some reason when I get this level of fatigue I don't want to eat anything uh, but uh, that's kind of where we are now I think I've got maybe uh, half hour left of work to do uh, I said I'm not going to be going food shopping though even though I've got a half hour left I would have uh, gone food shopping and, and then come back and finish the rest up. But that's not going to happen, so I'm just going to finish the rest of the work now. And uh, deal with everything later on. Deal with uh, the uh, food shopping later tomorrow. Hopefully, it, it was supposed to rain yesterday uh, on Wednesday. It's supposed to rain today on Thursday. It hasn't rained so far, so hopefully Friday it's not going to rain. And... Um, We'll have a half decent day to uh, go out and get something done. But as I said, I'm not really too sure where things are going. Uh, it really depends on the weather and, 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 and how I'm feeling. Uh, I might want to end up sleeping a little bit longer because uh, I am feeling more fatigued than I usually do. And uh, it's hard pushing myself that extra distance. So we'll see what ends up happening. Um, uh, when I get up again, uh, well, this is this is kind of this is kind of how things go. This is, I know, if you want to talk about the the, the excitement or suspense, uh, this is where the point. I'm at the point where uh, a lot of failures should be happening. Uh, where this is the point in time where normally I was too t normally I'd be too tired to vlog, uh, but I am making that effort to vlog now, so so you can sort of see this. Uh, to see the fatigue level of Matt. Though I don't know if it's necessarily that obvious, but uh, but anyways, uh, I'm working on uh, the Open IPTV uh, one point version one point four point four uh, one point. I'm actually using version one point four point three. 
uh, of sort of restructured things. Uh, maybe uh, tomorrow or in the, or the next segment of the vlog, uh, I'll show you what it looks like. And you can sort of see for yourself how I, uh, how I get things organized to a certain degree. Oh. Uh. I've got new vlogs I'm looking at. I like the different. I like the flam, family vlogs. Uh, the family vlogs, uh, actually better than I do uh, uh, the Disney shows like uh, L uh, *Live and Maddie* or or, or uh, *Grummy World* or you know the shows like that. Uh, I like sto short stories, and this is along the lines like, like the anime I like, where there's uh, it's the interaction that provides the story. The interaction between the people in in the in, in what you're watching. Uh, their interact, their their behaviors and how they interact with each other. This is my entertainment. It's kind of like like, like uh, people watching. I did. This is how I basically ended up getting into behavioral science and, and studying human behavior. Is I uh, went out to the, when I was going to the zoo years before. This is what I was, I've been doing this now for twenty five years. So before twenty, uh, so great more than twenty five years ago. I was going out to the zoo. Uh, watching the animals, watching the apes and stuff like that. And for some reason, I just turned around and started watching the people. And I found that the people watching the uh, apes and the uh, and other different animals, I thought that they were just as entertaining as watching the animals in the zoo. And so that began my, my whole uh, foray into human behavior. Even though... I was heading into astronomy and physics. I said, well, if you're observing stars and you have the understanding of observing stars and there's not that much of a problem, not much of a difference to turn around and start watching people as well. So, that was my for foray into that. So, that's, I guess, this is the same type of thing watching the shows that I like now. They're basically people watching. I'm just having some to drink now. I shouldn't have had the drink that I'm having now. Because I don't, it didn't matter. It doesn't matter what I had now. I still wouldn't be happy with it. And that's sort of the whole thing. We get this level of fatigue. It's the, there's a condition that, that sort of saps your happiness. That you're not happy with. You're not, you, you, you don't appreciate what you have in front of you. Uh, for some reason. You just want, oh, yeah, that was good, but could have been better. Uh, that's the type of feeling that you have. And the search for what is it that I want uh, almost continuously eludes you. Uh, but so the only option, the best option at this particular point in time uh, is simply uh, to go to bed and uh, deal with things when I wake up the next time, you know, when I wake up again. Because right now, it doesn't matter how I look at things in terms of where my mind is. Uh, it's not necessarily going to be a good thing. And this is what sort of hampers sometimes when you're in this sort of for in this state of fatigue. Uh, even writing uh, and uh, going through the analysis is rather difficult uh, because the negativity in your mind skews. Your your objectivity. So things you should be noticing you don't necessarily notice. You're sort of following through things, and so what I'm going to be doing right now is I do the last little bit of writing, last bit of note taking. I'm going to watch one of my favorite shows that sort of uh, I don't know. I whenever I get into the mood, I have this sort of these. Uh, these go-to videos uh, or, or things that I call my happy place. So one of the shows I'm going to watch now will be watching a little bit of Kim Possible and then going over to my fort bed. Uh, like a little kid, I've made my bed into a little bit of a fort. Uh, that's basically, you bought, I bought a bunk bed, didn't uh, put the top part up, but didn't put the top, put, put, didn't put the pot, top mattress on. And that creates a little bit of a fort there. 
And so, you know, when you're done the day, if you've been doing a lot of studying, you want to sort of have that nerd excitement and going back to being a kid again, well, there's your fort bit. So, uh, right now I think I'm going to watch some uh, Kim Possible and then go to sleep. <laughs> yep, 11 o'clock in the morning, I'm going to bed. That's my night time. It's the end of the day. I started at 9 o'clock last night. It was, uh, uh, you know, was it, uh, let's go check my, uh, my notes here. Um, yeah, it was uh, uh, 9.44 last, uh, on the 25th. That's when I started, so. It's been in excess of 12 hours, so it's just, it's, it's been, it's been a bit of, it's been a 13 hour day today, so. Uh, I think I'll leave it here, and I will talk to you in the next segment of uh, Big Bang Theory, all this BTS vlog. Alright, take it easy. Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to the next segment of uh, Big Bang Theory, all this BTS vlog. Christos and Esti, Messiah Kham. And Christ is written, risen. It is 22 hours and 52 minutes into the day of Thursday, May 26, 2016. I'm not supposed to be up right now. I'm supposed to be sleeping, but because uh, I didn't get to bed till till just about three o'clock in the afternoon. So, uh, and even that, I didn't really sleep that well. Uh, I've had a, I, I as I said in the last vlog. Uh, I wasn't feeling much up to anything. I couldn't decide what I wanted to eat. I was really in that, that sort of sort of funk that uh, where I was indecisive about a lot of different things. I eventually did find something to eat around 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, went to bed between 2 and 4. I think I finally fell asleep around 5. And it did rain outside, so there was no point in walking and going food shopping. Uh, we'll see what happens tomorrow for food shopping as well. Uh, but I did get a, a, a good chunk of work done on the music studio. Uh, so that's a good thing. Uh, I'm pushing out. I just finished pushing out the uh, the uh, 52nd episode. I think it's the, the uh, 52nd episode of Big Bang Theory. I was talking about uh, atheistic agnosticism and sort of getting into our definitions, and we're going to be leaving atheist agnosticism and just moving into plain agnosticism and sort of taking a look at the question of whether there is a God or whether it's, you know, you know when looking at anthropology, uh, where do the atheists sit, where, where does this sort of atheistic uh, branch of agnosticism, uh, where does it emerge, where does it pop up, and where is its existence in, existence in human history? Uh, and then we can go from there and look at sort of see what societies had done with this in terms of uh, uh, what nations popped up, uh, what type of geography do you have for atheism? Uh, and, you know, in other words, we're going into some more of the details on these things. Uh, and so we'll look more specifically at agnosticism rather than focusing specifically on atheism and then, and then go take our, our our path from there on out. Uh, I'm enjoying our, my open IPTV uh, version 1.4.3. That's uh, I'm, have, I'm very happy with it. Uh, I'm still working on uh, version 1.4.4. Uh, that's the next one. I don't know when it's going to roll over to 2. Uh, I suppose I have to finish a number of the different categories. In, in other words, uh, version 2 will have multiple different pages, so you can have a variety of different uh, categories of shows. Uh, and that's the sort of way I'll organize everything. I'll show you uh, maybe later on today. Uh oh. I don't know whether I'm going to be staying up or not. Uh, I have no idea what's going to happen next. I want to ask them to eat first. I know what's going to happen specifically, very ne you know, immediately next. But in terms of what's going to happen a couple hours, I don't know whether I'm going back to bed, whether I can, in terms of whether I can sleep or not, or whether or not 
I'm just sort of going to stay up and just, you know, uh, wait till my body crashes and then go, you know, <laughs> go to sleep then when, when, I ha when I have a crash. Because uh, sometimes, you know, if you can't sleep, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm tired, I'm I, I, sitting up like this, things are foggy, my, ver my, 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 my speech can be slurred. But when I go lie down, it, it nothing. I, I can't sleep. I don't fall asleep at all. My mind is still going, and I can't turn off. And so what happens is that you just don't sleep, and that's kind of the condition I'm in now. And so yeah, this is a, I'm making an effort. Then this is a making an effort to vlog more of the periods, where uh, I'm not specifically doing anything earth-shattering or, you know, very deep thinking. It's more of like perusing around. I was watching Nerd, Cassandra at Nerds uh, I watched, uh, she moved, she's moving into a new house and sort of, I guess, I guess I've tracked, because I've tracked uh, Cassandra, sort of watching Cassandra uh, from the point, of, from the time when she just left high school uh, and now she's, you know, moving in with, her, I guess, her this is going to be her lifelong uh, boyfriend. I don't know whether she's going to get married or not, but uh, uh, there, uh, other than the the official paperwork uh, of being married, they certainly are uh, in that uh, sort of situation, if you will. And they just bought a house together in in a sort of a wooded a wooded area in Vancouver. So. <clears throat> she's certainly doing well for herself, and sort of watching how where she came from because they, 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 I think there's sort of an affinity amongst us nerds when you see another nerd do specifically well and sort of achieve <coughs> the next levels, if you will. I guess you know if we want to view. Oh, I mean, I view think I view in many ways. I view life as a game. And that every time you achieve something new in life, you've achieved a new level. And that's sort of the situation here. It's what I see with Cassandra at Nerds RL. And I think it, 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 with the, the, my specific point about this is that uh, it's from her channel. That's how I started vlogging. It's from, from Cassandra's channel that I started vlogging like this. Because uh, I... It, it, at the point in time, see, my channel is all Linux. It's 100% Linux. There's no dual boot, boot systems here. And what this means is that I cannot fall back on, let's say, uh, Final Cut Pro or any other, the, the, or Adobe Premiere in terms of uh, movie editing. My movie editors are basically all on Linux. And you have to use what's there and you have to find workarounds for the different issues that pop up. And at the time I, I started vlogging, uh, the review from all of the um, vloggers, from the YouTubers, uh, who n talked about Linux, they, had doing, they were doing Linux reviews, also, you couldn't do video editing on uh, you, you couldn't do YouTube on uh, Linux. So I said, you know, that, that that was what I had seen before. That week before it was up to up to, up to uh, the basically New Year's Eve. New Year's Eve, I was watching Cassandra, I was still watching how she vlogged, and I liked the channel. It was really, really you know, I've been watching her for about a couple weeks. I said, well. You know, I had a laptop. Let's do a webcam. Let's do a webcam vlog. So I logged into uh, uh, my uh, Cyborg Alpha. Uh, uh, at that time, it was Cyborg Alpha. I logged in, did the first vlog. And then that became eventually Cyborg Alpha TV. And that was the beginning of, Cy uh, of Big Bang Theory RL. But if I hadn't taken that step, that sort of that, that and because she's sort of encouraging like that, she says, you know, well, take the step. If you fail, you fail. And if you succeed, just succeed. And, you know, you take things for what they are. And so I did that. I, I took that leap into doing uh, vlogging on <laughs> on an old uh, Asus Triple E uh, netbook with a chat that had a full desktop uh, uh, Linux serving on it, uh, and. 
it worked. It was it was fine. And then eventually I moved. I figured out how to use the different editors. I moved from the crappy old uh, uh, what I got on on, on YouTube. That I got from the, from the recording from a webcam. I was doing a webcam vlog. Uh, I got my first set of cameras, which were basically seven twenty p. And then I went some seven twenty p. Now I'm at a uh, full ten eighty p. And I've now got two cameras to vlog with. So. Uh, yeah, that's, I, I, I've enjoyed my time uh, moving up. It's been about four years. Uh, New Year's is always the, the my anniversary. New Year's Eve and uh, New Year's Day is my... Because that's when I vlog. I vlog... I, I, you know, I don't go anywhere for New Year's Eve. I'm kind of a nerd. I don't have uh, a lot of people who invite me places for New Year's Eve. So, I spend most of my time watching anime or I watch a Godzilla... A Godzilla uh, 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 a Godzilla marathon, and that's my New Year's. And now my New Year's is actually gonna be filled with. Uh, and since uh, uh, I can't remember when exactly, but uh, since I started vlogging just about four years ago, it's about two thousand twelve. Uh, New Year's Eve is uh, vlogging. <laughs> so, anyways, uh, I'm gonna end this here. And I'll talk to you in the next segment of uh, Big Bang Theory L's BTS vlog. All right, take it easy. Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to the uh, next segment of Big Bang Theory L's BTS vlog. Oh, and right off the start, we start yawning. <laughs> I was fine before the camera turned on. As soon as the camera turns on, oh, that's it. Uh, anyways, Kisos and Esti, Messiah, um, uh, Christ is risen. So let me give you a time and date stamp. It is three hours and 50 more min 55 minutes into the day of, uh, Friday, May 27th, 2016. And right now I don't have any internet, so, uh, finding other things to do right now. And, uh, it's delaying work on the music studio because I needed one, there's one system left that I have to upgrade, but, uh, can't do that, uh, well, um, there's no internet, so <laughs> apparently something happened in the neighborhood, and the uh, uh, the whole system is down. The whole neighborhood is down. So, uh, and it's been a it's it's been one long day since the uh, over. Uh, I think it's we're we're going f into uh, over twenty four hours because um, I was supposed to end my day. Around ten forty-five uh, yesterday morning, around uh, uh, on May twenty-sixth, but that didn't happen. I was I went, I went to bed. I tried to go to bed. I tried to go to sleep. Couldn't sleep. It's been like that all day long. So I found, I got up uh, up and down, did different things. So finally, I got up for a snack on the uh, uh, just around ten about ten forty-five. Uh, ended up doing some research, and uh, well, here we are now. It's uh, Almost four o'clock, and uh, now I'm I'm going to go get something to eat. I was supposed to get something to eat. That's what that's why I initially got up. Uh, but I had some work to do on the uh, on one of the episodes. I think the the the, uh, the fifty second episode I had to work on. Um, or the fifty third. I'm not too too sure. One of the, the recent recent episodes. Uh, but it, it 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 I did it. I know. I I got part of I got everything on on in terms of. Uh, Cyborg Alpha TV, but I didn't get the, the stuff on Cyborg Alpha TV network out because I stopped to look at some things that popped up in the suggestion box, and uh, it, it was well, yeah, it was uh, several hours later uh, that uh, the internet went down while I was doing the work on the uh, the side suggestions and sort of looking at different references, then. So now I'm less without uh, an to, to push out the second part I'll do it later when the internet comes back up again. But anyway, what we're, we're going to talk about is uh, uh, Cyborg Alpha TV network is not going to be your average network. People have asked me, uh, I've had some offers now for partnerships. Well, the problem is I can't sign any of the agreements. Part of the problem is is that uh, when you sign the agreement, you have to agree to use the YouTube's. Uh, 
a standard license, and my stuff isn't standard license. It's it's the free speech license. It's it's in support of of democracy, of democracy without limits. Uh, the way the you know is intended in the Constitution, but you know the American Constitution is. For all intents, intents and purposes, null and void. Now there's no, there is no more U.S. Constitution. It's now Obama. It's the Obama nation. Right. So, uh, and that's his rules. So, and part of the rules is that uh, uh, if you hear a song that you like, you can't hum it, you can't sing it, you can't talk about it, uh, because it's uh, copyright infringement. And that's the way it goes on uh, on YouTube and other places. So. I can't sign these agreements because I talk about things that the other people won't necessarily approve of. I talk about stuff that gets people angry. I go on to topics that you, know, you shouldn't be talking about these things. If you're doing research, and if you're being open-minded, why shouldn't you be talking about these things? The only time people don't want you to talk about something or they want you to shut up is when you're exposing the truth and they don't want to hear the truth come out. That's the only time they, 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 they're, they're concerned about these things. But the thing is, as a researcher, my job is, and part of what I like to do is, is look for this information. If you're the type of person who's open-minded, you want to uh, go further with your knowledge, you want to sort of push the boundaries of what you know, then well, this is it. And, and these discussions are here. They're in the BTS vlog. They're in the, uh, the behind-the-scenes vlog. This is where the raw notes come from, and everything else is developed from here on out. You know, as soon as the uh, the upgrade work is done in the uh, music studio, uh, that has the other two computer, the other com two computers that will be part of the next the uh, uh, editing bay. Done, uh, uh, but part part of the editing bay, the, the second second ed editing bay. Uh, there'll be more content coming up. I just, I need those systems free, in order to be able to do put forward more of the content that I want to put forward. But right now, I'm limited to what I have. And uh, uh, so maybe later, later on today or later on tomorrow, ton tonight, um, I'll have that done and I'll be start working on the next deck. The, uh, so the, more of the Insta vlog, I'll be working on more of some, uh, some maybe some, some documentaries, some of the TV shows I want to develop that for uh, Cyborg Alpha TV Network. Uh, a number of these different things. But here, it's, it's, it's cyborg. It's gonna be different. We're gonna go way beyond what you see on PBS and Discovery. PBS and Discovery is entertainment, and it's designed to be entertainment, and nothing further than that. Most of your news broadcasts are again are entertainment. They're there to give you a bit of information. Now nah, you know, and so you can have your discussions at home and uh, or wherever you're at. You can have your discussions about these different things, but nothing in the end gets ever done because. It always remains a topic to be discussed. But the thing is, we want to go further here. This is the, the whole point of this, is that we want to go further. We want to go beyond the simple discussion. We want to lift back, that, peel back those layers, and understand the fundamentals of what's going on so it can be changed if there's something wrong there. This is the point. But the thing is, is that, that many people don't get this point. They don't understand it. And the question is, is that you don't have to understand it initially, but if you want to go further, if you want to sort of improve what you know, then this is a, a necessary part of it. Again, it's, it's not, you know, it's not glamorous. I'm not launching, launching rockets at all. There's not na no nail-biting suspense. It's long hours, and we have our discussions here during these particular different periods of time where, you know, uh, where I'm sort of in between things. As I've just finished one set of uh, research now. I'm going to have some dinner. So, uh, or something to eat. Actually, not just dinner is a long time, long, long gone. Uh, uh, the food schedule, one, breakfast, lunch, and dinner is long gone. Uh, so now I'm going to have something to eat because I'm hungry. <laughs> uh, anyways, uh, I'll come back, uh, you know, uh, maybe when I go to, right before I go to bed, if it's like another couple hours, I'll go back. I'll come back and give you another talk, but uh, and have another discussion with you. But uh, right now, that's it. Uh, the clip is the uh, SD card is now going to go into the editing bay. This is going to be it for this episode. So, anyways, uh, I will see you in the uh, next segment of Big Bang Theory, which will be in the next episode. All right, take it easy and goodbye. Welcome to the library.
Ready? And I am a librarian. I am the professor. And professor of what? Professor of physics. Oh, say, can you see? Democratic Earth, Earth.